Herzlich willkommen zu einem neuen Tutorial hier auf dem YouTube-Channel der Easy Credit BBL. Heute zieht es uns wieder unter den Korb. Ich bin zu Gast in Braunschweig bei Scott Etherton. Hey Scott, thanks for having me. So, you are one of the more versatile big men in the league. Um, what do you consider your greatest strength? Um, I think just, you know, moving without the ball, uh, rebounding and trying to sneak behind team's defense and get some easy points for the team. I think that's one of my best strengths. And uh, since there are so many things you can do on the basketball court, what does your summer look like? What do you focus on when you, when you try to get better? Uh, mainly focus on trying to get stronger in mm -hmm. the weight room. Uh, there's some big guys in the league and, you know, you have to be able to wrestle with them in the post. So. That's one of the biggest, and also just trying to strengthen all the little parts of the game. So what type of player is harder for you to defend? Like a classic, a typical low post center, or players that can step outside and are more versatile like you? I would say the typical low post center, uh, big strong guys that can back, back people down. Mm -hmm. They also have weaknesses, so you just have to be smart when you play against them. Right. So you've averaged more than nine rebounds for the last two seasons. Are you able to learn rebounding or is it just instincts, will and hustle? No, I think it's kind of half, half and half. Uh -huh. You know, a lot of it's a will and hustle, um, but you also have to have kind of a feel for where the ball is going to bounce. And sometimes people are you know, more born with that. So I think it's 50-50. So show me the perfect box out. What do you look for? Um, usually you try to go to where the opposite side of where the shot was, because uh -huh. that's where the majority of the balls bounce. And then you want to get as low as you can, and you want to back into your defender and try to push them out. And so you have room to go get the ball. Let's say the shot is coming. There it is, you got it. So what Rebound. do you look for next? You want to catch it strong. Uh -huh. And then you want to look for the point guard to push the break on offense. Sometimes there'll be a guy leaking out, but um, usually the first look is for the point guard. Once I pass the ball, it's uh, my job to sprint down the court as fast as I can, and then we start the offense. So you just talked about uh, moving off the ball. So let's say I drive to the basket. What do you look for? How do you react? Uh, where do you go? Let's okay. say I go baseline. If you drive uh, from the wing to the baseline, you want to rotate to the middle and try to be an option for the guard to pass to you so you can have a dunk or a layup. Now let's say I go to the mm -hmm. middle. Then you want to go the opposite way, under the basket, then try to sneak behind your defender so they can also throw another pass to you right here. Das war's mit dem Tutorial. Vielen Dank fürs Zuschauen. Thank you, Scott. Ihr habt's gesehen. Auch mal an den kleinen Dingen arbeiten. Abseits des Balles bewegen, ausboxen, auch das ist wichtig. Ihr habt es hier von jemandem gehört, der was davon versteht. Lasst einen Daumen hoch da, trainiert fleißig und hier in der Beschreibung findet ihr auch alle anderen Tutorials. Viel Spaß dabei, bis bald.